Welcome to Super Starcraft Bros. Lightning. I'm Jay. And I'm Iron Sparks. How you doing, Iron Sparks? How's it going? What's up? I'm good. You good? You? Uh, tired? I hate daylight savings time. It has thrown off my entire week. That and the fact that I have to work a lot extra on Friday and Saturday, that's also throwing off my week because it's like... Aliens. It's like you're getting through the tunnel and at the end of the tunnel is a giant woolly mammoth. Who's somehow a carnivore. Well, do we want to see if there's a tunnel in this game? Let's do it! Do you want me to say who's playing? Yeah. And our bottom right. I want to see the tunnel. Our bottom right corner, we have our red protest. Um, um. Mm, um, 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 um. And his opponent, the blue protest, Grimid. Grimid. That's a mid sized Grim. That's like a little, a little Grim Reaper. And we got a proxy. Caution! Caution! Proxy pilot. Indeed, so it looks like we're going to be seeing. Maybe something cheesy. Uh, proxy two gate. Why is he building that back there? Why not? Interesting. All right. Uh, yeah. Grimmond has a proxy pylon throw down. Uh, to the left of the expansion for Uman. Mm -hmm. It's making me hungry somehow. I'm sure there's tunnels down there. Yeah, it's good. I mean, that's like an elevator or something like that. All right, so we do have uh, one gateway down for Grimid, and back at Uman's base, we do have the gateway already placed down. It's about 80% completed, plus gas is on the way as well. Um, that's a disgusting alien in a tank. Weird. Looks like an investor. Yeah. All right. Uh, let's see, we got gas going for Grimid now. Uh, gateway is almost finished. It, it's not... It's definitely not your typical cheese. Okay, there we go. We got the second gateway going down now. A uh, little, little off on the timing. Um, and we have Cybernex Core coming down for Uman. So, Iron Sparks, how do you feel about this cheese? Do you think it's it's gonna work? Uh, you know, I feel like whatever is gonna happen is gonna be a deciding factor in the rest of the game. That was the most generic sentence you could have used. I could have said stuff's gonna happen. Ooh, proxy Cyber. So he's just gonna build his entire base over there. Wait, well, you no. Know, why put a base in your base when you can have a portable base? That's not really portable, but it's not at home. It's like a base away from base. It's like a... It's like a... I got nothing. I have no metaphor for that. I gotta sneeze, though. Look uh, at that. That is hidden. It is hidden. It's in the base, but it uh, is no longer hidden. That, that sneeze. Oh. Alright, Proxy Pylon gonna get picked up by the Zealot. It's gonna hack and slash away. We do have a blue Zealot moving on up now. Um... I, I don't I, I don't really like the proxy pylon. I mean, he doesn't have warp gate tech yet. Uh, I'm not... I don't know. I do like that uh, both players have the super zealots. It gives them vision. I guess, but I mean... I don't know. I, uh, I feel confused about it. I don't feel confused. Alright, we do have a stock right now. It's going to be able to uh, take some pop shots they're on like, that zealot. They're like trying to marry each other. Uh, yes. W wait, what? Mirror. Oh, mirror. I thought you said marry. I'm like... <laughs> Big Protoss get married while they're in the middle of battle. I'm just... Why not? Alright, let's see. We do have more Stalkers on the way for Grimmid. Uh, just building in. We got another Stalker that warped in. We got probes pulled off the line for Uman to do some additional damage. They do take out that initial Zealot that the Stalker will fall. The Zealot should be pretty soon. I would imagine him not to only lose one of these Stalkers. <laughs> uh, no, he actually does micro those Stalkers away and gets them out before they're picked off by this other Stalker. Uh, second gateway is warped in for Uman. More probes are pulled off to deal with uh, the stalkers now. Damaged stalkers do come back into the base for Uman. All the stalkers are getting pulled now. We do have another stalker that is now out. Uh, that's pretty much what, uh, I got. what do you got. I mean, they, they will take out two of these stalkers. I got, he's kiting the stalkers, but those probes are getting an unnecessary amount of hits. A little bit of micro to get that uh, stronger stalker in the front. Two more stalkers warp in now. One gets picked off. Another one is going to get picked off now. These do get pushed back. Don't... Ah, uh, there we go. I was going to say, I'd hope that they'd stay on the high ground a little bit. Maybe pick off this pylon. Um, and actually, if you can pick off that pylon, you can supply block the blue player. Yes, but will he do it? Ah, uh, no idea. Uh, let's see, we got another stalker coming in. We got more probe production, but now we have a fresh little battalion of stalkers. And you know what, Iron Sparks? I I, I don't feel confident for the blue play or red player. No. Probes are coming in to attack that pylon. 
And you know, I'm actually kind of amazed. During all of this, Grimmett didn't go for uh, Warpgate. And now uh, it looks like uh, Grimmett does win. Yes, Bummer. he does. Cheesy. Yep. Extra cheesy. All right, guys, leave a comment down below. Hit that like button. Share, subscribe, and favorite. Greatly appreciate it. Uh, send us a new replays in at superstarterbros at gmail.com. How is it possible? You yawn every time. Don't glare at me. Hope you guys have a great day. Good luck. Have fun. GG.